Hi guys, I'm back from my vacation and it's hard to believe the time passed so fast. We were in Stockholm and now it's Monday and I have some things to do. And also today will come a master to install our blinds finally. I didn't mention but it's very hot in sunny days here. It's maybe 29 degrees here so you can imagine how it feels. I even found raisin on my wooden table so... Mm -hmm. So yeah, we will excited that we will get our blinds today. And now I will work on a sketch for my lovely client. Yeah. But first I will make some packing stuff. My current workspace is still not organized and my wall is so empty. I just can decide how I want it to look and if I want it to look like at my previous place or to make some differences. Decisions like this are always a pain to me. So I hope I will decide something before the end of this year. And the story of the next illustration is very interesting, because I already made similar illustration with a man, and it was made as an album cover for my music band, and now I was commissioned to create a similar illustration with a female character for a book cover. And I realized that I become more comfortable with painting trees with watercolor and I loved how it turned out. From the new discoveries I really happy with my new watercolor brush. Basically because I used to use my very old brush from my childhood that I really liked. I was using it on all stages of creating an illustration because it has a thin tip but it was made of a squirrel hair. Meh. And using this new synthetic brush that we actually bought for apartment repairs, I realized that I like it even more than my old brush, because it's not so soft and it's easier to control how watercolor paints behave. By the way, this brush is from my favorite brand, from which I always buy my flat brushes for oil paintings. So it was very useful and also a thick discovery. I had to make some digital work with this illustration to make it a cover. Oh yeah, during this time we was watching TV series Chernobyl that quite well explains why I'm actually alive and I realized that I didn't know almost anything about this accident before and it's such a shame guys. I was experimenting with watercolor recently. Actually, I have an idea of watercolor illustration and I wanted to practice backgrounds first. I have a lot of sketches that I am not sure I will ever paint with oils, but it would be such a pity to bury them in my sketchbook forever, so I'm thinking about giving them a second chance in watercolor illustration format. Thank you. 
So yeah guys, that's it for my little vlog. Thanks for joining me today. I also will be happy to see you on my Instagram. The link is in my description by the way. And I will see you again soon. Bye!